Ever wondered what's actually happening inside your chest every time you breathe in? Welcome back to IZCC's Biology Chapter 11, Respiration and Gas Exchange. All right, let's get into respiration and gas exchange. Respiration isn't just breathing in and out, it's the process your cells use to release energy from glucose. There are two types, aerobic, which uses oxygen, and anaerobic, which doesn't. But for today, we're focusing on the stuff with oxygen. Gas exchange happens in your lungs, which sit like spongy bags in your chest. Every lung is packed with millions of tiny air sacs called alveoli. Think of them as microscopic bubbles where oxygen swaps places with carbon dioxide. Now the lungs aren't working solo. Between your ribs, you've got intercostal muscles. They're like the ropes on a bellows pulling your ribs up and out when you inhale. At the same time, your diaphragm, a dome-shaped muscle below your lungs, flattens out. This combo increases the volume in your chest, which drops the air pressure inside your lungs. Result? Air rushes in, bringing oxygen with it. When you inhale, the air you breathe in contains about 21% oxygen and 0.04% carbon dioxide. Exhale, and it drops to 16% oxygen, but shoots up to 4% carbon dioxide. That's your body swapping gases. When you exhale, your intercostal muscles relax, your diaphragm domes up, chest volume drops, and pressure inside the lungs increases, pushing air and all that waste carbon dioxide out. So next time you take a breath, remember it's not just air, it's a high-speed swap keeping you energized and alive, no manual required. But what if your body can't get enough oxygen? That's when anaerobic respiration kicks in. Anaerobic respiration happens during intense exercise like sprinting, when your muscles need energy fast and oxygen can't keep up. The downside? It produces lactic acid, which makes your muscles ache and tire quickly. Afterwards, your body needs extra oxygen to break down that lactic acid. This is called oxygen debt. So whether it's aerobic or anaerobic, your body has clever ways to keep you moving. Stay tuned for more IGCSE summarized content.